Hello and welcome back everyone to day 22 of the Daring Adventure. And today is the day where we will fly. Now the first thing we need to gather is more forged steel. It's the only thing that I'm pretty sure we don't have enough of. I'm thinking it's about 250 or so for a gyro. And then we need another wheel. But luckily I've placed one to craft already and it's already done. Very nice. And you will also note that we don't have the ability to craft it yet. But not for long. So I'm hoping... Oh, four points. Okay, okay. I'm hoping this is going to be enough. I believe we need ten. Yeah, intellect ten. How much does it cost to get to nine? Three points. Oh, if we didn't have these glasses, we wouldn't be able to do it. That's it. We have to leave it at nine. And then we have one point. Please be cost only one. Yes. Yes. And there we go. Avionics wizard. I am going to be able to fly. Please, 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 please. Probably today. Who knows? Okay, we're going to need eight headlights. I need to check on that. But I'm pretty sure we do have them. If not, there'll be some on the boxes upstairs. Ooh, speaking of the boxes upstairs. Thank you so much, guys, for letting me know that the pistol up there... I had a level one pistol in a box up there. It had a mod. And it did. So my hunting rifle now has a scope 2x, which was what I had over there on the pistol. Very, very exciting. I still want to see if I can put the silencer on that because that would be just absolutely amazing. Yeah, I can. I mean, I'm not going to. I need another silencer, of course, because <laughs> I, I love the silencer on my pistol. It's a lifesaver. But if I can get a silencer on the hunting rifle, then I don't really have to carry around my primitive bow anymore. It would just be lovely. Uh, if this has already burned, yeah, we're going to toss. Oh, I feel bad for this little sledgehammer, but it's got to get cooked, you know? We need to get this forge steel one way or another, so we're just going to keep smelting as much as we can. I also got my dukes on me because I figured if we are able to craft it, then maybe I'm able to fly off somewhere and buy some stuff. Uh, but let's quickly check for some headlights because I am going to need some. And I don't know if I haven't... I definitely have enough. <laughs> I was worried. And I don't know why. All right, there we go. We have our accessories going. Our chassis is going to need... Well, you know what? That's not that bad. It's a lot cheaper than I thought. It's only 125 forged steel? I need duct tape. Oh my god, it's the, it's the opposite thing. I thought it was 250. Maybe I'm thinking of the 4x4. Is the 4x4 more expensive? Yeah, I am thinking of the 4x4. The 4x4 is the one that is 250. I could also get me a 4x4 now that I think about it. But no, no, no. Obviously, I'm going to be short on everything. Duct tape it is. Let's get to cooking some bones. 65 murky. Okay, there we go. So we can make 65. Honestly, I don't even need that many. Uh, so let's go ahead and make like, I don't know, 35 of these. Just not to go too crazy. It won't take that long. And then hopefully we'll be able to craft the rest. I know I'm not going to be able to fly off right away. I know it. But at the very least, we're going to be able to get fly off very, very soon. I am so excited. 24. 25. <laughs> yes. Amazing. Do I have everything else? I have the wheel. I will have the accessories. I have an engine. I have a battery. I'm even using the cheapest one. I still don't think it matters. Um, let me know if that has changed, but I don't think it matters the level of the battery. I also have a level six, but I definitely don't want to use it if I don't need to. So I'm going to keep this one for now in case we ever get, you know, electrical powered batteries, whatever system. And that's it. We're just waiting on the two minutes. Two whole... Okay, you know what we could do while we wait? Which I think is probably a good idea. We need to find a color for the gyro. I'm guessing a pink gyro is in order. You know? We gotta look good. We gotta look good to feel good. And I was also thinking... If there's any mods that I can make, that would be amazing. I mean, unfortunately, all the ones that I have are for the little drone that I still don't have. <laughs> oh, I feel so bad. It hurts my soul when I think about it. But yeah, I don't think... I wonder if there's a vehicle mod right now. Ooh. We can make the headlights mod. That could be nice. It's fairly cheap. And that would be cool. Expanded seating. Obviously, we're not going to need it here because I'm all alone. A fuel saver mod would be absolutely amazing. Especially on a jet. Holy crap, that would be amazing. And the fuel tank mod... Uh, supercharger. Does this make it go faster? 
The supercharger mod increases vehicle acceleration and top speed. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Um, I, I think I would do the acceleration and the saver mod. Because, yeah, the fuel tank, uh, I am known to fall off the sky a little bit. But if I actually pay attention to it, which I won't. But if I actually paid attention to it, it wouldn't be that bad. Uh, see, I think I'm going to do it. I'm going to get the vehicle mod light. I know it's not good, but I have nothing else. So who cares? <laughs> you know, it's the one I have available. So it's the one I'm making. And now it's just a matter of waiting. I just uh, got to patiently sit here and wait for this to craft. One more minute. Oh, I am not a patient person. Yes. <laughs> I've not been freaking out for the last uh, minute or so. It's been fine. It's been absolutely fine. Oh, very nice. It's going to take three whole minutes. I don't know. I can't just sit here and stare at this. It, it's going to drive me absolutely insane. Uh, let's just go ahead and work on this. I mean, I really wasn't planning on doing it, but what else is there to do, right? We might as well live a little. And by live a little, I mean not really, but chunk some stone here. Eh, anything will help. I'll leave it. Oh my god. Never mind. Uh, madame? I, she's so lovely. She's making her way to the horde base. How nice of her. All right, I am digging my little heart out, but my stamina is so garbo. And I am yeah, so close to three-shotting this. It's so painful. All right, so I got to digging. It's not that far down, but a little bit. And what I was thinking is I'll dig it too wide, right? Uh, but then it wouldn't have a side. I have to think about it. But I think it would be fine if I put a plate there or something. And then hopefully it would fall here. Right? Like, I'll have to move that over here, but that's okay. I think that's my best bet because of all the things that I did, you know, up there. So, it's fine. <gasps> yes, it's definitely fine. It's here. It's arrived. We have it. Oh, it's a beautiful day, too. Oh, it's going to be amazing. You know what? I didn't even think about um, my little gyro. It doesn't have a home. There's no runway for it. <gasps> Maybe I make a runway on the roof. Oh, yes, yes, yes. I'll make the little area, throw my explosives, and then I'll make like a little landing pad. It's going to be hard, but I've landed in worse, right? So it's going to be absolutely fine. <gasps> Look at this beast. Oh my God, it's so good. All right, I'm going to open it, of course, as one does. Um, And let's put this here for the... Oh, it's gorgeous. Wait, what? Oh, no. It can't have the, the lights. Well, well, well. It's fine. Look, like, maybe we'll put it in my bike. That would also help, to be honest. And the bike's still going to be useful, but... I'll be honest, guys. After, um... After having this, am I actually going to use the bike? Mm. <laughs> I don't think so. I'll be flying. Let's lift off really quickly. Oh, yeah. Just to test it out. But I'm going to slowly land here. This is a little bit of a disappointing small trip. Uh, hello, Rex. Before you come into my shop. Yeah, 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 yeah. So look, he did not have the beaker. Unfortunately, and well, predictably, to be fair, it is wrecked after all. I am going to pick up this drop. And then I was thinking we could go around the whole world. Just explore it all. I want to find the wasteland, the proper wasteland. Maybe there'll be a city there. You never know. Oh my god, is this in the water? <laughs> it certainly is. It certainly is. Oh well, this is how the day starts. What can I say? It's good, it's good. While I pretend to swim over here and hopefully not die, I am going to go around everywhere and I'm going to find this. I think this is going to be fun. Uh, we'll see how it turns out. Holy, how far is this? Regardless, while I slowly swim here above the water so I don't drown, um, I will say I'm going to go around and visit everything. Absolutely everything. I am very excited about it. And maybe we'll hit up all the traders. That could be really good, right? Um, see if they have any beakers, which would be lovely. I really would like to have a chem bench ASAP. I know I can craft it. So I just need the ability to do so. 
And uh, other than a beaker, uh, let's just really quickly double check if I need anything else. No, it's just the beaker. I'm cooking pots. Everything else is fine. A uh, bottle of acid, maybe we need a couple more. Uh, but I know that's been made a lot easier, so I don't think it's going to be that hard uh, to find a couple of extra ones just in case. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be my goal right now. Acid beaker. I'm on top of it, guys. Trust me. We will go to every trader in the land if we have to. And oh no. Um, I'm really hoping I don't drown here. Was this worth it? I don't think so. Uh, but <laughs> I'm committed. If I die here, this is gonna really suck. Don't drown. Just don't drown. Just don't drown. Come on, come on, come on. There's a landmine here? What kind of treachery is this? Alright, alright. Just make it out, just make it out, just make it out. I'm drowning, I'm drowning, I'm drowning, men. I'm drowning. We need to. Where is the where's the surface? Oh <laughs> I've never been so happy to see the sun. Alright, alright, it's fine. I'm gonna be wet, but I will not be dead. So I'm gonna head back to the to the bike now and uh see what we got. I see it. Now, you might think I'm speaking about that zombie, but no. I'm talking about that chicken. I want it. I want it bad. Got him. I really love this scope on this. <laughs> oh, worth it. Thank you so much for that tip. That's amazing. Everything I needed. And now that I'm safe, let's take a quick look. I got a range mods bundle. Okay, let's go ahead and open that. Ooh, it's a 4X scope. Now, I do think 4X scope is a bit much for me. I'm not saying it's, you know, much for everyone. But for me, I think so. Uh, aimed accuracy increases damage, range, and aimed accuracy, but it makes the weapon more unwieldy from firing the hip. I don't think I care about that. Yeah, yeah, definitely a barrel extender mod is good for a hunting rifle. Uh, the 4X scope, I mean, look... Look, look, look. It's intense, you know? It's just like, it's it's a lot. I prefer the 2X. It's up to you, really. It doesn't actually matter. Um, but I'm not going to be using the 4X, so I'm just going to get rid of it. The shotgun tube extender mod increases the capacity for pump shotguns. And I do like pumpies. So if I am able to find a pumpy, then I'll definitely probably use it. And I would like to have it. So I'm just going to keep that one. Get rid of the other one. And life is going to be good. And just without uh, further ado, though, let's go visit a couple more traders before they close. <gasps> There's another drop right there. Oh, God. I'm so greedy. I'm so greedy, but I want it. <laughs> oh, my God. Are you kidding me? I got a freaking beaker from that box. Well, but you see, this is why you have to stop for all the loot. You have to. You absolutely have to. Oh, wow. I just... I... Yeah. Uh, what do you even say to that? What do you even say? What a day. What a day. You know what? I'm still going to that trader. One, it's a nice scenic route, you know? And we'll get to see the ocean here. Uh, we get to see everything around us. And now I can finally see... Oh, yeah. Look at this city. is enormous. I can actually see the cities from above to see what exactly they have in them. You know, what kind of POIs we're working with. That's going to be really important. Uh, I'm going to try not to accelerate, so I'll get there when I get there. Actually, the gas is not a problem. I accelerate away, little gyro. And we're going to hit up this trader. Then we're going to hit up the trader in the snow that I know about. And then we're going to keep flying. You never know, right? You never know where the day slash probably night will take us. Oh, there's another wheel here. Oh, this is nice. A wheel would be nice. Uh, lucky looters. You know what? I'm gonna buy them. Hopefully, that's gonna be good. At least, uh, in the near future. And... Oh, here's some honey. You know what? Let's go ahead and buy that, too. I just hate running out of it. And I think we don't need the blade trap anymore. We're good to go on all that stuff. And let's just check really quickly if he has acid. He has grenades. Oh, that would be nice. Uh, but let's check really quickly if he has a beaker or two. I don't think I need another beaker, though. I think one is good enough. I'd like to have two camp stations sometimes, but I think one is going to be more than enough for the time being. 
And so I'm just going to go with that. He's got some grenades, right? Which I am considering, but I don't really like the contact grenades as much. I, like, I prefer the other ones. It gives me more control, I feel. Okay, but we got a couple of things. Let's go ahead and sell that. I obviously need, I'm not going to keep this, so goodbye. And I uh, can even sell the wrench. It's fine. I have plenty of All wrenches. Right, now that we're done doing business, Thank you. Oh, how dare you? How dare you, man? I'll take more cans, of course. Uh, I don't need any of the other stuff, even though coffee. Now, let's buy that. It's expensive. But one, when I'm digging, I'm really going to be happy I did that. And how much money do I have left? 5,000. Eh, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. We have Lucky Looter Volume 3. Find more brass and loot. Yes, please. Uh, Lucky Looter Volume 2. You can never have enough ammunition. Find more ammunition in loot. I appreciate both of them, to be honest. That's exactly what we needed. And I'm going to go ahead and drop as much as I can over here. Take my food, of course. I'm going to go ahead and fill this up. I'm not going to have any incidents, okay? I'm not falling off the sky. Not this time, at least. All right, and now that we've finished with this guy, we're going to have to go all the way over here to Jen. There's a box here. Oh, I hope that box has some some acid. That's all I need, really, uh, to get this camp station going. Hello, gentlemen. And off we go. Wow. I can't believe I discovered so much of the map just on the motorcycle. It just shows how good the motorcycle is, really. Uh, that's a nice little base right there. A couple of army bases, it looks like. I do enjoy those. But I'm going to really quickly just visit Jen. And then we're going to hit up those those snow towns. That looks amazing. We'll also keep going to the left there. Because as you can see, we're on the east side of the map quite a bit. So we need to investigate everything else around. This is an AK map, okay? I am going to go discover everything. And if it's pitch black when I'm discovering it, it's going to be pitch black. But I'm still going to go find it. Uh, get used to the sweet, sweet sound on this gyro. Because I am not going anywhere without it. <laughs> okay, let's see, Jen. Uh, really quickly. She's got a bar brawling. It's never a bad thing. Robotic sledge! 6,500. I regret everything. I would really like a robotic sledge. Damn it, Jen. Why did you have such an expensive one? Look, she has it till day 25, so I have plenty of time to come back. Uh, just in case, let's go ahead and check for Asin. I don't think she has any, otherwise I would have probably found it already. Uh, but she does have a robotic sledge level 3 for 6,500. Nothing this time. Nothing this time. I'll be back though with some money, don't you worry about it. Gonna get this, 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 this. I am going to be plenty canned by the end of the night. Alright, off we go, off we go. It's gonna get dark, but don't worry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Imagine. It's not even dark yet. And I'm already running into rocks. Everything's fine, right? Once you bump into something, just don't get discouraged. It's just the beginning. All right, and I'm going to head... Here. Oh! <gasps> Aerial attack! Aerial attack! Please, now. I am so fast. He did not even get me. Wow. Look at the whole city from up here. This is absolutely gorgeous. Uh, this is the little snow town that we were at before. And I believe we have a little bit of an outpost here. Or a couple of outposts, actually. We have the tower somewhere here. The clock tower. And then we have the little tiny tower in front of the trader. I'm only seeing snow towns, though. This map must just have a ton of snow towns. We've been here before. It just looks so much better from above. So much more grand. It's absolutely breathtaking. I love the towns in this game now. It is... It's really what made Alpha 20 Alpha 20, I feel. The layout is beautiful. The ambiance is beautiful. The terrifying screams that I make at night when I'm running through the town. Not so beautiful. Meds? Hello, Jen. Alright, she did what she does best. She betrayed me. She does not have any acid. I'm gonna grab just the food here. Maybe the skull crushers, maybe the health bar. Yeah. 
I want to take it all, to be honest, but I don't want to run out of money. That's the thing. Ink damage it would be nice. Oh, I am so greedy. Just take it all except the golden rod. I, I usually don't have to use that one. Okay. I still have 3,900. Okay, that should be able to buy me enough acid at least. And let's go ahead and venture out to the latest trader, which is this one. Which I think it's by the little outpost there. And I should be fine. Yeah, this is not here. I see a cat. I see a zombie. Let's take off before it's too late. Oh, yeah. <gasps> no, 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 no. Oh, my God. Please don't die. Don't die here. Not like this. I just panicked. I panicked. Absolutely panicked. 37%. All right, how bad could it be? I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna make it to the trader. I will. Uh, the trader wasn't that far. It was like right here. Ooh, th there's also those little houses there that are under construction. That might have some construction boxes, which might have acid. Right? You have to think about things that way. Oh no, the fog. 500 away. There's no way we make it. Absolutely no way. I mean, I can dream, I can hope, but it's 2154. And it's definitely closed. <laughs> oh, no. Look, we gave it a go. We gave it a go. Now, I, I have to decide what's more important for me, right? First, let's land because I'm going to need some gas. <gasps> there it is. There is the sound. You hear zombies behind me? I have to be really quiet. All right, let's go ahead and feel, feel, feel. Crap. Feel. Stop rolling backwards. Okay, we're off, we're off. Everything's fine. Everything's absolutely fine. I, I can go and try to get an acid, which is fine. I mean, I can look for acid any other time. It's not a big deal. Or I can go discover things. And I'm gonna go with, I'm gonna discover things. Look how beautiful the sunset looks. Wow. And yeah, it's gonna be foggy. It's gonna be cold. But... It's gonna be fine. Oh, wow. <laughs> I've never noticed that. At the top of the tier 5, that light is shining. Is actually shining. And ironically working. <laughs> For air vehicles. Wow, and the snow. The Fates Motel. Oh, I lived there. That was my last series. Wow. Wow, wow. It's just gorgeous. Uh, I'm heading towards the random marker that I placed here because I just haven't been there before, so I figured we might as well head there, right? And see what's there. There's really no reason. <laughs> I plan to run anywhere that I haven't been to before. I try to discover the map a bit. If I, if I stumble in another city, that would be lovely. I'm just trying to make sure that there's nothing in this map. Left unexplored. Okay. There's a little shotgun messiah here. A couple of farms. I was following the big road. And it looks like we stumbled across what looks like it might be a little town. Oh yeah, this is the same thing. This is the same layout with all the, um... All those types of properties. Maybe I could try to go, do, go sneaky, you know? And see what we got. Let's see if there's anything else here. Yeah, there is a whole town. It's like a whole thing. Another snow town. This is craziness. So this doesn't look like it's a huge city. It just looks like it's a, maybe a small town, small village. So we do have a wasteland town. I don't know how big it is. It looks pretty massive. Okay, it is pitch black. Unfortunately. <laughs> As one does. Uh, but it was somewhere near where we were going to explore. We're going to go explore down this way next. Uh, but I wanted to check out if there was anything on this left side of the map. And it does look like we might have a town ahead. Just, um, it got really dark all of a sudden, so, you know. It is what it is, but I just followed this big road. Just, if you're ever looking for a town, if you're ever looking to move, or you're ever looking to find a different biome, just follow the large roads. Uh, especially out of the big cities. Uh, they will always lead you somewhere else. They're always very interconnected. Wow, here we go. Oh, and already a bird. What is the luck? I see. Wow. Okay. Maybe it's not a town, but I, I thought it was. I could see it from so far away. Maybe it's just further ahead. Which, you know, it, it certainly could be. Certainly could be. I don't 
think it was clutter. I could literally see the lines. So, yeah, it's gonna be up here. It's gonna be up here. Just believe. Just believe. Oh, my God. Thank you. I was starting to lose all hope. Oh, God, I just saw that my life flash before my eyes. There was a bird on me. Yeah, I thought I was going insane. But no, no, no. Here it is. Here it is. It's to the right. I don't know how big it is, but let's just walk around a little bit and then we'll find out. Oh, they have a nice little area here. Very nice. A lot of farms. That's always good. It looked large from the distance, but it could just be like a little village, you know. And it's just because it was so far, you just couldn't really tell. Wow. Okay. All right. We do have it. We do have it. A full wasteland town. I could stay here, I suppose, for the day and see what we can find out tomorrow. I mean, today, I guess. <laughs> it's already 2 a.m. I'm a little hungry. I'm a little thirsty, but I bought so much stuff. I should be fine. Uh, let's keep exploring because it does look like this might be a little bit bigger than we would think. And if we find a cool POI, you know, why not? Let's just do it tomorrow. We have that church there that's been reworked. Very nice. The SOS house. I don't know if that's been touched. Um, but I don't remember it really well, so either way. Lots of houses I'm looking at right here. Might be a little bit dark for you guys. I don't know. Uh, it does look like an enormous city. Oh, wow. Okay. We have this big place here. Which was lovely. I think I have ran it before, but I'm not quite sure. It looks like a warehouse. Of sorts. Oh, either way, that would be lovely. Ooh, a tier 5 up ahead. Another little storage facility there. A car place. <gasps> it just, this is a poppin' pills. I mean, I do need some acid. It might be the thing. I can't do it again, right? That would be nutty. If I do it, it would just be like super sped up and <laughs> you guys would see nothing. All right? Don't worry about it. Just would know that it happened. Oh, and then we have one of these places. You know what? I really wanted to run one of these places. All day I've been seeing them, right? This little half-constructed roundabout homes. And I haven't been able to do it yet. So maybe it's like destiny. We have to do it. It's meant to be. We have another Shaka Messiah too. Which would be kind of lovely. We already ran it. But, I mean, it gives you loot. So, it is what it is. Birds, please. Leave me alone. I'm trying to enjoy the town. Um, another bird. And a bear. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, we're getting away from him. We're getting away from him. Uh, away from the bear. Uh, oh, shiitake. Okay, run. 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 Evasive maneuvers. Evasive maneuvers. I cannot believe that just happened. <laughs> I hate them so much. I hate them so much. All right, we're landing. We're landing. SOS. SOS. <laughs> Wee woo. Let's get down. Look, it's almost 4 a.m. If I could just not die out here in the middle of nowhere, that would be freaking fantastic. All right, I, I don't even know if it's a good idea to actually land, but I am running out of gas. And uh, I think it would be cool to stay one day. Just one tiny day in this area. I think it's probably fine. I, I can't imagine anything would kill me, right? Um, anything else would kill me, right? I think we can do this. We can do the open house little area. It's nice. It's in this biome, which is pretty cool. Maybe we do this little farm here. We'll just spend the day in this wasteland. And I think that would be cool. We explored so much. Uh, we've flown through so much. Uh, there's so many towns in the snow. I think there was even another town up north. Uh, that I could see. So we've gone far. We had, did not make it down here. So I still don't know what's down here. Obviously, we have a town right next to ours. Maybe there's another one to the south. I actually don't know. But we know there's nothing else over here. It's just the ocean. So if anything, there'll be a couple more towns up there. Maybe one more town up there. And oh, I have not explored anything to the left over here. Yeah, there's still a lot of the map to discover. But look, we have found a town in the wasteland. And I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it. We will be here tomorrow. Hold on to your panties. Clench those butt cheeks. It might be a rough ride. Thanks as always for watching. Remember to leave a like if you enjoyed this video. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. Until then. Bye.
I do not like the look of that bear. 